And now I'm going to expand a little bit the circle, the head and, and the body circle concept by trying to do figure eights with my head at first and then with my head and body. Okay, this is really fun, okay? So instead of doing this type of circular movement, I will do this type of figure eight movement. That means that my head will do an upper circle and then a lower circle towards the, the, the opposite direction. One, two. Okay, and of course, this is our figure eight pattern. Okay. And you can see now that my body always follows. Okay, so I'm not doing this kind of uh, totally isolated movement. It's all, always... Uh, you know, uh, head, body, legs, everything works as a unity. But at the beginning, just try to acquire the skill by doing it with your head, your neck, and just your upper body, all right? Okay, and uh, what I can do again, I can apply change to the side, the forward and backward movement, okay? So now it's be, it will be something like this. Again, you won't have to do this all the time, okay? This is just a drill to help you acquire the skill. Once you acquire the skill, you can, do, you can uh, use it tactically and uh, in an actual fight the way you want, just for a second. Okay, but this is something that will make your movement totally unpredictable. Okay, and this is something that you should, should pursue as a, as a goal. 